Chicago. Thanks so much. Mark Krisky is outside to celebrate St. Patrick's Day, and why not? Yeah, we're out here with Megan Henderson, and we've got a special St. Patrick's Day treat and a special St. Patrick's Day chef. We do. We are actually celebrating St. Patrick's Day with some Irish cooking. We're saying welcome to Stuart O'Keefe. You may recognize him from the Food Network's, uh, is it real... Private chef Private said Beverly, Beverly Hills. Hills. This Not real housewives. housewives. Private, I mean, confusing. all the same. You know I what I mean? Know. Who cares anymore? But now exactly. you're Irish. Exactly. If you're Irish. Are you allowed to get away with it? Because I don't I, see green here. So I, this I, is like an olive green. I kind of. It might look gray to you. Oh, nice it's try. Yeah. Green. It's yeah. It's um, you know, I'm born okay. and raised there. So I mean. What more, you know, do I really He's need to wear the, the green anyway? Exactly. That's all he needs. Yeah, he's all here. <laughs> well, welcome. You actually are, uh, uh, shot a show in Ireland as well recently, yes, right? Yes, I just was home at Christmas uh, shooting my own TV show, uh, The Lazy Chef. Oh, nice. So um, it's kind of like how I cook. I like to get in the kitchen for maybe about 15, 20 minutes, prep food, get it in the pot, and then just let it, like, just cook slowly and just for like a few oh, hours. Oh, that sounds great. You're talking yeah. to the two laziest cooks <laughs> yeah, exactly. you could ever meet. So, all right, tell us what you've got today. You're going to start with so a soup recipe. It's all Irish. So a soup recipe, I have a potato leek and broccoli, and the broccoli Yum. kind of gives it that green, and it's like healthy. It's all like great vegetables for you. Um, you know, just cook off all the vegetables. Some uh, some vegetable stock, just like simmer for about 20, 25 minutes, and blitz it in a blender, and you're done. There's your Fantastic. soup. Fantastic. Easy, yeah. easy. Moving on to Moving the on braised over. ribs. Braised they ribs. look this great. Beef and Guinness short ribs, and you're gonna taste them right now. Absolutely. It's early in the morning. Yes. You know oh, no, no. oh, never too early for us. Yeah. yeah. And I have them on a bed of Colcannon mashed potatoes, and it's a really traditional Irish dish. We have um, some spring onions, some cabbage mixed in with the mashed potatoes, which uh, just gives the potatoes so a real vibe, great. another level. So the meat is not mm. hard to cook. No, it's a like boneless show hard. rib. You get okay. a farmer's market, your butcher. So tender. And you braise it, it for about two and a half hours. Yeah. Prep time is about 25 minutes. Then about two hours in the oven. Do clean the house, whatever you want to do. Have a beer at St. Patrick's Day. And know? what is the secret to fantastic mashed potatoes? How do you like yours, first of all? I whip them in a blender. Oh, Like it, okay. with like a ham mixer or like, you know, a KitchenAid mixer. What do you add to them, though? Do you add milk I or add carnation milk? Or? some like non-fat milk, a tiny bit of butter. And, you know, if they're... If I want to get them really, really soft and fluffy, I had some maybe like chicken stock sometimes. Okay, now people in Ireland, do they like it a little bit chunky or smooth? In Ireland, funny enough, more chunky. Oh, interesting. All in right. America, it's about really smooth, yeah, like, like silky mashed yeah. potatoes. I love that. Okay, this I love. Beer and milkshakes. Okay, so we're going to make a milkshake yeah. right now. It's like a Guinness chocolate peanut butter milkshake. This is amazing. Just for today. So we have like two scoops of ice cream, just vanilla ice cream, your favorite one that okay. you can find at the market. Add I've never heard of the idea of beer and chocolate right. and uh, ice cream mixed and together. Of course, Guinness. I have yeah. to so do this like often? A you put beer in your milkshakes often? It's fun. You know what I mean? <laughs> Only in the morning. I'm arguing with it, Only in the morning. <laughs> when alcohol is involved, it's always fun. Amen yeah. to that. Amen to that. I have a cab picking up right here. All right. That is so interesting. So, one of my favorite new things is Magic Bullet. Do you have one at home? I don't have one, but Layla, our producer, has one. I you have, have one. Mark oh, absolutely. has one, of course. And I've been this close to buying one after watching the infomercials. Well, after this, after today. Yeah. You're going to go down and get one. There you go. Look at that. Right. Yeah, as go. easy as that. Have a taste. Uh, I, yeah. Don't you, yeah, absolutely. Don't you think And you shaved a little bit of chocolate on top of the other on ones, top. too. Some fresh whipped cream, if you want it. You yeah. taste the Guinness yeah. in there? It's like oh. old buzz. <laughs> little, little, little thing of it. That is good, good stuff. Okay, I'll be so, hammering this back in a second. I uh, know you will be. Hey, so folks can actually hire you to be their private chef. Yeah, yeah, they can. I mean, I still do dinner parties. It's kind of the whole reason why I was on the Private Chefs of Beverly Hills show right. in the first place. You know, um, you know, I travel around Los Angeles, Beverly Hills, you know, fly to San Francisco sometimes. Wherever people want me to cook, I'm there. You're there. Do you get got homesick the money. on there. this day or do you get homesick on this um, day? I, I call, call home to mommy and daddy and just kind of see what's going on but usually they're kind of in the pub at this time yeah. so ah. it's eight hours it's eight hours ahead they're so they're drinking now all right time. grace i want to tell folks you can head to our website uh, ktla.com for more information on how we can hire you and also for these fantastic these recipes, recipes yeah. happy st patrick's day to you Same thank to you. you for coming top of the morning top of the morning down. all right we're sending it over to jessica over to you